Welcome back to Living 808. The fourth annual High Fit Expo is happening this weekend at the Blaisdell. This two day family friendly event celebrates all things fitness. Here to tell us all about it, one of the guest speakers at the event, celebrity fit mom Maria King. Hello, thank you so much for joining Thanks us. Thanks for having me. Okay, I want to talk about you and, and what you're doing at the expo, but first, give us an overview for people who've never attended the expo before. If you have never attended the expo, get ready. It's everything fit. So if you've ever wanted to be healthy, if you wanted to learn more about nutrition, if you want to know about bodybuilding, workouts, this is the place to be. You're going to have so much fun. I love it. It sounds like everything under one roof, mm -hmm. right? A place to get inspired. Exactly. And bring <laughs> everybody. Bring your friends, bring your family. It's a very family fun event. We're looking at some video from uh, previous year's events. Looks like um, you've got competitions uh -huh. there. Looks like you've got classes there. Mm -hmm. um, it's a really great oh, yeah, place Zuba, to learn. Dance. <laughs> yes, I love dance. So you'll find everything. I mean, fitness is not just about running or biking or, or just training the gym. It's about boxing, it's about Pilates and yoga and dancing. And so I love that you're learning more about how your body works and being inspired by other people who love fitness like I do. Terrific. Well, tell <laughs> us about your journey. Did you always love fitness? I have always been aware that I needed to love fitness. And I think most people um, know this because, no, me meaning that everyone knows that they need to be healthy. Yes. My mother um, struggled with a lot of health issues. And I knew that there was a correlation to how inactive she was and how poorly she ate and how, how many diseases she had in terms of heart disease and kidney problems and diabetes. And so I was uh, very aware that I needed to take care of myself because I had the same genetics. I started working out in my teens. I, you know, had children born in 2009, 10 and 11. You know, I've dealt with my ups and downs in terms of my weight, just like every woman out there. But um, I, I work out probably three to five times a week okay. and I try to stay healthy. Okay. So I want our audience to, to know this. You are a mother of three. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. So you're very busy. Yes. Um, how do you make time and, and what tips do you have for other busy moms on, on how to find the time? You know, for myself, being a busy mother of three, it's really important for me to prioritize, meaning that I need to get up and work out immediately when I wake up in the morning. If I don't, I start doing other stuff. Yes. And you know what? I, another thing is, is that if you can't work up in the, wake up in the morning and work out, just make it a priority. Um, I've been accused of, you know, from people who look at me and say, oh, that's all you do is work out. No, I, that's not what I do. I, it's one of the five things that I do in my day. Some of it be my family, my work, household operations, and fitness. It just needs to be part of your routine it needs to be a priority somewhere like yesterday it was raining here in Hawaii and I actually got 30 minutes in at home at 9 o'clock at night just because that's all I had but um, but yes I definitely think you need to make a priority try to do it in the morning try to prioritize your meals you know mm -hmm. plan it as much as you can and don't make excuses I mean Everyone has reasons why they're challenged in anything they do in life, mm -hmm. but if you understand your reasons, your mm -hmm. motivation, why you want to do this, it makes it a lot easier. The truth is, we can all find time to do it. If it's right? important to you. Yeah, I mean, they have, and that's the thing, I struggle <laughs> with this, Maria. I really do. I struggle with it yes. every day yes. because it's not enjoyable to no. me. There's nothing about fitness that okay. I enjoy. And this is why I think <laughs> people need to go to the expo because it's all about who you hang out with. I always say, who who you are today is because of everything in, envir in your environment, including the people in your environment and the things in your environment. Mm -hmm. Fitness is fun. You need to find what works for you. If you yeah. love to dance, dance. Okay. We're yeah. almost out of time, but I know that you, we want to get you to teach us a few quick exercises that people can do. Yes. Okay. So I love doing the squat. Squat's such a basic thing. I want to okay. do it with you just because you're, you're dressed up and I okay. don't want to. Yeah. <laughs> so go ahead and put your feet a little bit shorter width apart. Okay. Okay. Your feet should be facing forward and you want to drive your hips back like you're sitting in a chair. Yes and then come come on up so you want to make sure that your butt's coming off back a little bit yep yep chest is up shoulders are back this I love the squat because it's a multi-muscle movement mm -hmm. you're working everything you're getting your heart rate up so a lot of people say oh, I don't have anything I have no equipment I have no gym well, <laughs> no, you can, excuses. no excuses you <laughs> can just do a hundred squats at home just like this and you don't have to do it all at one time you could do a little bit here and there so that's a great you know tip for you guys for you and for everyone at home thank you so much so that's what I was gonna ask you so you think maybe a hundred squats but you can do maybe 20 20 20 yes throughout the okay, day sure. but honestly what I think is is you can do anything whether it's squats walking going uphill as long as you're getting your heart rate up for a good amount of time because you want to work on your heart 
heart mm -hmm. health, your endurance. So okay. I would say 20 minutes. 20 minutes, people. You can find it. <laughs> Get off your social media. 20 minutes. <laughs> Maria, thank you so much. Again, the High Fit Expo is this Saturday and Sunday at the Blaisdell. We had all of the information up on your screen. We'll have it on our website as well. But thank you so much. Thank you. You are inspiring me <laughs> today. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Coming up on Living 808, Ready Player One is a big hit here at home.